Well, we made it down to Chatham. Oh, I hope we get a bite. Staying positive. You see the whales, the tuna are generally with them. We started to hear them. We set up basically down to see them. Tons of bait here that they're feeding on. Hopefully the tuna come through this. Just deployed our first two baits. We'll see what happens. We won this thing last year by coming down to Chatham all the time, but also by working with the hot tuna. So we're going to continue with that as long as possible. Did you find the whales, Bob? Yeah, we know they're upwind of us. We can hear them. OK. We're right close to Bob. He's just right up the line a little bit from us here. We're just crying like babies here. That we can't get a mark or a bite. And... Me and Bob Cook on the fat tuna stay in contact on the radio when we're fishing in Chatham. Anyone that's willing to steam down here and put in the time and the effort deserves to be given the right information. I thought we'd be headed home by now. Ah, of course, we all did. I heard a rumor that the hard merch is fishing in Chatham, which to me is odd. You know, he's the one who's been hating on Chatham. He says he's going to stay local in Gloucester. I think it might be BS, but it's too early in the season to stress about the other boats. Usually when we're cooking, we hook up, so hopefully it brings us a little luck here. I'd love to bend the rod and get in early enough so we can get back out here tomorrow and do it again. Oh, there he is. We got a bouncer. Hopefully we get a nice one. Haven't heard the wheels for a little bit, huh? No. They definitely moved on. Can we smell them? Oh, oh. we're on. Oh, yeah, we're on. 150, seems real, seems real. Bob's got him on. How deep? 150. That's got to be right in front of his face. Woo! We're on. Good one, good one. And this is why we come down here. Get it, buddy? You know, they can say what they want, let us burn the fuel we want, but this is where the fish at. Whoa! What is that? See, shark. You got it? Yep, thanks, buddy. Yep. You know, full bellies always keeps the crew happy, so when you're in a good mood, you usually hook fish. There he is. Got them all, baby. Woo! Saw the rod balancing round tight. You know, fingers crossed this turns into a tuna. I was hoping it's not a shark, to be honest. It's swimming up awful fast. I feel like it might be a tuna, personally, only because a shark, I feel like, would come up a lot faster by now. Oh, see? That's him, right? Just took some line off the reel that time, man. You never know. Definitely a tuna. I'm not sold this is a fish. Fingers crossed we can land this thing and uh, head for the barn. Ready, Johnny? Uh, yep. Yeah. Treating it like a tuna every single time. I moved it up a bit. Hope it's the right one. We'll see how it goes here. Come on, go. Go. Come on. Not a shark, not a shark! Let's go, boys! Here comes some weights. Oh my god, what the hell's that about? I can see the glow. Yeah, it's a shark. He's gone. Just came off. Oh. Well, that was a little bit disappointing. Ah. Get back to the drift and hopefully hook back up. Let's get him. Let's, let's get, get him, let's buddy. Get him. We are on fuego right now. Let's go. Go to, go to port. Go to port. Forward, forward. There he is. No, no, hold on. All right, brakes. Come up right here. Nail him. 